you are welcome to class. Today we are going to be seeing Pythagoras theorem as relating to right angle triangles. So first we are going to see, see what the theorem states. In a right angled triangle, the square of the hypotenuse is equal to the sum of the squares of the other two sides. So we have a right angle triangle there. That sign there is the right angle, meaning that the angle between A and B is 90 degrees. That is the hypotenuse, which is the longest side, the side facing the right angle. So C square is equal to A square plus B square. That is what the Pythagoras theorem states. So let's see its application in solving problem. So we have a right angle triangle right there. Let's label the sides. So A, the B, and the C. Okay, side BC is 3. Side AB is 4 cm. We are looking for side AC, which is the hypotenuse. So we are just going to apply the Pythagoras theorem. So we we'll say Y square is equal to 3 square plus 4 square. So 3 square is 3 times 3, which is 9. 4 square is 4 times 4, which is 16. 16 times 4 is 2. So if y square is 25, when you take the square root of both sides, y is equal to 5. Okay, let's see another one right there. Okay, let's say the hypotenuse is 15, given to us this time around, while the other side is 12. So we want to look for side x. So we are still going to apply our Pythagoras theorem here. So the square of the hypotenuse, 15 square is equal to 12 square plus x square. So 15 square is 225, 12 square is 144, then we put our x square. Now we subtract 144 from both sides, so we have x square is equal to 225 minus 144 which is 81. So we take the square root of both sides, our x is 9. Thank you.